Hi, my name's Jim and I've got a couple of quick tips uh, for people doing craft fairs. I've got one in two days time. So I'm just getting all of my things together uh, and preparing for that. And I realize when you get a craft fair, I, the one I go to is an out, outdoor one. I get a three meter gazebo and two six foot tables. The tables are made of wood. So when you're putting wood onto wood, it doesn't stand out and you've got a lot of wooden products around. It, it becomes too, too woody and doesn't look great and nothing people can't see what you're selling unless they're right up close so they're not going to come over to you because it just likes bland so what i've done is i've made a couple of things to help raise them off the table and also of quite horrible colors just to make them stand out so i put a bright blue tablecloth on on the table to make anything to put down stand out so any wood against that really stands out um, I've just finished making this. This is a hanging board. Uh, it's just an old piece of pine I had lying around, not doing anything. Uh, a couple of holes in the top, just for some string to hang it and some nails to hang stuff. So um, yeah, this is gonna hang on the gazebo. It's quite light, uh, cause obviously gazebo, I'm gonna hang on on the gazebo frame, uh, but it will just allow me to hang up some of my gear. Um, so I've got a, a key hook hook put your keys on just something basic and it just raises the level up people walking past can see this it's a bright color so it'll you know draw people's eye and then they may come and have a look at the products um so yeah really easy to do just a bit of paint but a few nails it was shocking pink it was something i had left over from my daughter's bedroom um but it was so bright i've just sanded it back so you can just see the grain coming through uh, so it's not quite as bad and just gave it a quick spray with plaster coat which i got from one of the cheap shops i think it was about six pounds seven pounds for a tin gave it a couple of sprays with that and you know that's waterproof and and great the other thing i've done is i've made a shelf unit which is collapsible because obviously it's a, it's a craft fair so i don't want a big shelf unit but again i wanted to lift things off the table and i wanted a bright background on it so i've got a blue background um, the reason I put the backboard on wasn't initially for colour, it was because it was quite windy and some of my stuff looked like it was gonna gonna blow off so I thought if I put a backboard on that'll stop anything blowing off and great so I'll show you how this works so just take my uh, flight of ale off uh, really easy bit of six mil ply painted bright blue and then sprayed with the plaster coat that just slides out yeah. Easier said than done. There we go. And then what I've done is I've got two uprights clamped with speed clamps and shelf units with slots cut out so they just slide in and out. They're held up with dowels and they just slide off really nice and quickly. As you can see, taking this table, this shelf unit apart, putting it together is an absolute piece of cake. It all lies pretty flat. So when I'm packing away, it can go in the car. When I'm setting up, it's quick to do. The sides are just feet. I've just glued and screwed them in. Cut a little lip out for the speed clamp to go on. And again, that just raises things up. Bright colour draws people's eye, so it doesn't look bland and horrible and wood on wood. And hopefully, that will entice more people to at least come over and have a look at your gear. And yeah, hopefully, fingers crossed, sell more stuff. So, if you are doing craft fairs, think on bit of colour in there, get some height on it, and hope you make a fortune. Cheers, guys. Speak to you soon.